Have you ever needed to create a video but didn't feel like pulling out your camera and all your gear to create one? Well, with PowerDirector, you can create a video out of thin air using a text prompt. So today, I'm going to show you how to use text to video master mode with Google VO in PowerDirector 365. Let's turn our imaginations into reality. I want to create some underwater B-roll for a video that I'm making, but I don't have any underwater camera gear. So I'm going to let PowerDirector create one for me. There are a few ways that I can get to the text to video tool. Go to the media tab. You can go down to video B-roll generator. Click on that. And then you can click on text to video. Go ahead and close that out. The other way that you can get there is by going up to Gen AI and then going to text to video. First thing that you'll want to do is come up with a text prompt that you want to use. The more detailed your prompt is, the better the results will be. So I already have a prompt figured out, so I'm just going to copy and paste it in here to save us all a little bit of time and misery. Now we'll talk settings, but before we set up this underwater wonderland, I need you to click the like button, subscribe to Power Director University, and click the bell so you don't miss out on any of my tutorials and live streams. So the first setting is mode. In order to use the Google VO 3.1 or later versions, you're gonna to have to select master. This is gonna get you the most cinematic, lifelike type video that Power Director can muster. Then you want to choose your duration and I'm going to leave this one on four seconds and you want to select your aspect ratio. I'm going to leave this one on 16 by nine. You can also choose to generate sound with the AI. If you choose to generate sound, it's going to cost you more credit. So I'm going to uncheck that box. And then when you're done, you see how many credits it's going to cost you. And then you click generate. You receive a message telling you that the creative video will be located in my creations once it's complete. I'm going to go ahead and click on got it. And I'm going to open up my gen AI creations. And you can see it spinning here for AI video generator. I'm going to left click on that. And I'm just going to wait for the file to finish. You can see here that it's going to take a while for it to be done. Once it's done, you can click on view. This looks like some real deal underwater shenanigans to me. You can click on download to export it as a new video clip, or you can click on add the timeline to add it to your project in power director. I'm going to left click on add the timeline. If you want to make a person in a picture, do something that someone else did in a video, check out this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe and purchase PowerDirector using the links in the video description to help the channel stay alive.